And now it's time for Bum Reviews with Chester A. Bum. Tonight's review... Oh my god, this is the greatest movie I've ever seen in my life! Eh, whatever Captain America's catchphrase is mixed with spoilers! There's this guy named Captain America, and he's working for the organization SHIELD! To help stop the evil organization SHIELD! You see, pirate Samuel Jackson found out they're up to no good, and so he's like, Captain America, I'm gonna die. Yeah, sure you are. No, will it? I'm going to die. No kidding, the leader of the Avengers is going to die. We put it in the trailers, we put it on YouTube videos. Yeah, okay, with your last words, tell me something vague that practically nobody would be able to figure out. Trust nobody. Yeah, that's original. Oh, I'm dead! Mm-hmm. I really mean it, I'm really dead! Yeah, where's the microchip, disc, DVD, and or jump drive that you want me to get secret information out go. of? Thank you! So Captain America wants to be sure that the jump drive is kept safe? So he puts in the safest place possible. A vending machine! That was a really dumb idea. Vending machines are around because people still use them. On second thought, it's not that unrealistic. I once found a radioactive grenade in a vending machine once! It was really spicy! So all these agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. tried to get Captain America in this elevator? With his greatest nemesis, TASER STICKS! Our Bullets and grenades too expensive to use? They shouldn't be! Half of our top secret weaponry is in vending machines, apparently! But Captain America kicks their asses and so S.H.I.E.L.D. is like, This is the world's most wanted man. We must somehow create a giant taser stick, or something that can throw taser sticks at him, or something that can blow up into a giant taser stick! Why don't we just shoot him? Yeah, that works. So Captain America meets up with Black Widow, who has yet to have sex with somebody and then kill them. Though I'm holding out for Cat Dennings, that's just a win-win. And she goes with Captain America to see what's on the jump drive! And they find this underground lair from World War II. And it turns out the jump drive is actually the mind of the evil scientist from the first one. No, not Red Skull, the one you don't remember. The one who looked like a mix between Peter Dinklage and Francis from Pee-wee's Big Adventure. What do you care? You don't remember him. But he's black! And he's like, in the 40s and 50s, I backed up my mind into a computer. What? You guys couldn't even invent Pong yet! This was actually our first attempt at Pong, and somehow it morphed its way into this. Science, weird. Well, what's your evil plan, Tim Curry villain from Captain Planet? We have perfected a technology that can see the future, and so we're gonna kill all the awful people and murderers before they become awful people and murder it. But wait, wouldn't that also mean killing the people that are killing those people? And then killing the people who are killing those people? And then killing the people who are killing those people? This is a stupid plan! Well, what do you expect from KIND OF NAZIS? Oh my god, KIND OF NAZIS? They're the worst kind of evil that there kind of is! Kind of! Kind of. But this other guy who used to be dead but came back to life and now has a metal arm? I call him the Elric Soldier. He's trying to hunt down Captain America and Black Widow to kill them! And the Elric Soldier is like, You will never guess who I am! Oh yeah, sure, it could be anybody. It's gonna be a real big twist! Big enough that you don't show it on the poster? What? Hi, Bucky. Okay, so it wasn't a good twist, but at least you remember me! Well, yeah, somebody has to. Hey! I played a very big part in the last movie! Oh, yeah, I'm sure it's what everybody was talking about in the last film. Boy, not that Red Skull or that Captain America guy. Bucky. Ooh, he was something. Hey, I remember me! No, you really don't. Oh, yeah, you're right. That's why I want to kill you! Well, let me just get my pizza pan of America and fight! Ha! I thought you were more than just a shield! All right, I'll lose it. Now lose your metal arm! No! Because I know that's pretty much all I am. Because you're so forgettable, even putting you on the poster will make people not remember who Die! you are. Ooh! So Captain America and Black Widow escaped to find out the biggest surprise ever! Pirate L. Jackson is still alive! Oh, wow, didn't see that coming. Yeah, I know, should. I mean, you really convinced me. Oh, my God, Pirate yeah, I heard Jackson you the first time. is gone. Shut up. What are we gonna do? Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, up shut up, shut up, shut up. We might get my own movie. So they bring back into S.H.I.E.L.D. to warn all the good S.H.I.E.L.D. people about the bad S.H.I.E.L.D. people? And they're like, good S.H.I.E.L.D. people, do you want the future to be like Minority Report? You mean filled with a million plot holes? Because this movie already kind of has that. Just trust me, a guy who's been on the run, all of you have been told to kill, and I'm just asking you to suddenly take my word all of a sudden. All right, but only because you dress like the red, white, and blue pancakes from Denny's. So this big explosive action scene happens, and there's this cool guy with wings named Falcon, and he's like, I will bring back Silverhawk. So they stop the evil Robert Redford obvious bad guy, claim Pirate L. Jackson is dead because it worked so well the first time, leave it so that nobody's running shield for the moment, Black Widow's off to make her own movie, Captain America and Falcon are gonna look for what's his name? Bucky! Nobody cares. And America risks soundly knowing that the government is no longer watching and listening to every single solitary thing that we're doing. The end! So Captain America the Winter Elric was really great, and I'm especially looking forward to those evil siblings that they were building up in the middle of the credits. I always thought the Wonder Twins were DC though. This is just a wee bum saying. Change! You got change! Oh come on, have a guy out, will ya? Come on, change! I swear it'll go to Mickey Captain America 3! What the hell are we thinking going up against Batman and Superman?